Okay, welcome back, dear friends.、Uh, sorry about the notifications.、Uh, today, I'd like to continue our series of one hop. The virtual machine would be Dev One. I will put the link into the description section below so that you can download、uh, the image. Before we begin today's video, if you don't mind, please subscribe to my channel. I do appreciate your help and support. So now let's get started. To save time, I have already imported this virtual machine into the virtual box. So now I'd like to go into the kind of links. So as you can see over here, I have already done the identification of the IP address as two hundred and fifty-four, and also did the map scanning. I did the scene scan, the virtual scan, and the script scan. I also did the comprehensive scan by specifying the option of dash tp dash p. Excuse me. And from the map scanning results, as you can see, the two open ports. The first one is twenty-two, which is running SSH surface, and also the actual version information and、uh, version、uh, number. Of course, as we know, this version doesn't have doesn't have any vulnerability. And the second one is eighty, which runs HTTP surface and also the actual version information. So naturally, the next step would be to do we would be to do some、uh, more for the more immersion for the eighty port. So now I'd like to open up our uh, browser, uh, Firefox, and、uh, we can input the IP address. So I think this is just、uh, the default. A page of the Apache two, and also you can check the source code, but nothing you you can find from this、uh, source code, and also we can check the、uh, whether the target or site target site has robots file, but not found. It's okay. So now I think it's time to do some directory、uh, scanning or immersion by the two of GoBuster. Uh, to save time, I have already done it、uh, earlier. As you can see,、uh, GoBuster.、Uh, and I I think、uh, the, if you are familiar with my uh, my uh, video recording, I always use the GoBuster and the GoBuster、uh, specify the dir dir command and also the URL、uh, option and the word list option and also the extension option. So I think uh, uh, GoBuster has already. Discovered one directory which is www.dev. So now we can access this directory. And、uh, from the status of the browser, and this、uh, directory is trying to connect to outside. I think、uh, there's some、uh, JavaScript code inside the. Inside this page, but of course、uh, we have already configured this virtual machine as host only, and、uh, it will it will not work uh, to uh, make a connection to the outside. So、uh, we just wait for the browser to be timed out. I think、uh, to save time, we can use the Q command to、uh, retrieve the content of the this directory,、uh, which is www.dev. And as you can see, we have already successfully retrieved the the source code of the this directory, but nothing、uh, special here. So what can what we can do is we can, we need to do some further more immersion for the directory www.dev, and we also we can use like a dear search www.dev. So as you can see,、uh, we we can know the under、uh, this directory there is some sort of the. A、uh, JIT a repository, and we just、uh, wait for this to be completed, and I'll come back. Okay, it, it's done. I think、uh, besides the JIT、uh, directory or repository,、uh, 
uh, nothing special we can find. So I think for the JIT uh, repository, we can use the two like uh, JIT hack and also the JIT dump. JIT hack, JIT hack two or JIT, JIT dumper. But I can tell you when I did this uh, virtual machine, uh, from the JIT hack too, I cannot uh, get uh, useful information. So I, I rather like uh, to use the JIT dumper and uh, to save time, I have already uh, cloned this tool from the JIT hub. And we can go to the this directory. And we just uh, use Python and um, specify the directory of the JIT. And uh, specify the directory. Uh, uh, the, 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 this directory would be, uh, we, we output our information into this directory. For example, like a backup. Uh, sorry, module. Okay, I need to fix this issue. Okay, uh, I think the error, uh, the reason why we run the, this uh, script or this two, uh, we have error. It says, sorry, I need to find the error message. Yeah, this error, no module named uh, dot which. So uh, this would be, would be solved by install uh, this module. And you can use this command, the pip install dot which, and uh, specify this option. And after we install uh, this module, then we can run uh, this command without problem. And uh, as you can see, go to the backup. We have already cloned information from the target uh, JIT directory, and we can use the JIT uh, lock. Yeah, and uh, the two uh, commit, and we can get the first commit. Uh, we can check out the first commit, use the JIT. Check out, check out, and the ID. Okay, no problem. As you can see, now we got uh, a new file. The name is crate. We can cut the crate. And here, uh, you know, uh, when I did uh, this virtual machine the first time, I thought uh, this would be the user name and this would be a password, but uh, it's not. Actually, uh, this password, this just uh, uh, encrypted password, and we can use the cyberchef to help us decrypt cyberchef. And the encryption is Vig, Vig, uh, yeah, this one, Vigneer. We can track the algorithm and uh, we can make a copy. And uh, this one is key. Make a copy. The, the key is here. And now we got the password. We can make a copy and uh, make a note on our pad. And now we can log in. And uh, as you can see, uh, if we uh, go to the uh, Jitter lock, as you can see, the user. I think this should be username, and we can make a copy. 
and digit. Uh, sorry, not SSH. And make a copy. And specify the IP address of the target. Oh, we need to remove the cached key first. And uh, here. And uh, yes. And uh, we can copy the password and paste in here. Yeah, no problem. And uh, now we need to elevate our privilege. Normally, of course, we can make a very basic immersion. We can get the user flag here. And uh, so how to elevate our privilege? privilege? Normally, we can do is sudo to see whether there is any command with loot privilege. As you can see, there is one command, JIT, and without uh, in specifying the or uh, giving the password of a loot. But uh, how to elevate? We can go to the website of GTF Obins and uh, the JIT sudo section. So how to do? Uh, maybe maybe we can use this one. Yeah, sudo. And uh, can this one. Uh, yeah, now we are loot user and go to the loot directory. Now we got a loot flag here. So that's all I'd like to demonstrate in this video. I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.